These are all dwellers. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one, and even this one are all dwellers that I have put into one world. These dwellers like to watch you from a distance and after some time run towards you and try to kill you, and it's pretty scary. God! All of the dwellers are different with their own ambient sounds and animations, and all of these dwellers spawn in caves. The twist about this world that I'm in, though, is that the world is all caves. I'm going to be spawning in a cave, and my goal is to reach the surface. The problem is, though, the entire surface layer is obsidian. So I need to get a diamond pickaxe and break my way out without dying. And that's no easy task, because we're in hardcore mode, and one dweller is enough to completely take me out, but we have six. Oh. That sound design, man. Okay. We're in. Oh man, this is gonna be pretty crazy. I know- I don't know what every single dweller does. Uh, like, I know they're a bit different in some way. They all kind of have the same gimmick. Where they sit there and they watch you, like they spawn randomly in caves. Uh, but, you know, some of the dwellers are different from each other. I believe one of the- Oh, that's just a spider, okay. I believe one of the dwellers doesn't do anything. I don't know which one it is. But I believe one of the dwellers doesn't do anything. It just, you know, tries to scare you. Okay, that's stone. Oh, that's loud. There we go, let's make- let's make our tools. Uh, some of the dwellers, you know, they can go through one block gaps. Actually, you know what? I'll keep that there. Can't see anything. Can't see anything, but we have a stone pick. I'm gonna mine the stone over here. That's copper. Would be nice to get uh, coal for torches, but that's okay. But yeah, I think one of the cave dwellers also can climb up walls. And none of the other dwellers can, I believe. Nah, I need to get some of this. Or not some of that. Some of this. So yeah, I mean, there's, there's a lot to look out for. Honestly. And I think the first line of business is to get a shield. I'm gonna die so quickly if I don't get a shield. I have no way of protecting myself. But, I cannot see any ore, because it's so, so dark. That's a spider, I hope? Wow. I mean, it is like pitch black in here. I went ahead and changed the shader so I could see a bit more. I see this coal in front of me, so I'm going to change the shader back. But with this coal, we can now see. Oh, nice. And there's some iron there as well. Let's not waste any time, really. I don't know when any of these dwellers are going to spawn. So may as well get iron while I can. And we're also going to need food. Oh my god, what is that? What is that? Nah. We should be safe in here, though. We should be safe in here. Oh man, I don't like that at all. Okay. Okay then. Oh god, I mean... What is that for? And it's gone. Hopefully... Oh 
Oh my god, what are these noises? see anything okay I think we're safe wow okay I'm not gonna lie that was pretty terrifying I'm putting that there <laughs> I'm putting that there Okay, we have a shield. I feel a lot more safe with the shield. A lot more confident with the shield. I don't know why I'm trying to make more. Whew, Jesus. I'm gonna keep that in my five slot in case I need to run back. But my God, that was scary. I hear some movement over here. It's just a creeper. Okay, that's good. Just a creeper. Oh, man. <laughs> this is rough, man. This is really rough. Okay. I'm gonna get this iron. Ooh. See, I don't know what their spawns are like inside of the cave. No, oh, that's gold. There's iron, but I'm trying to be as cautious as possible. But food is going to be, I think, a big challenge. I think that will be my biggest challenge in here. The only thing I'll really be able to eat is rotten flesh consistently. Unless I can find a dungeon, right? But good luck with that. Good luck finding a dungeon. Oh god, this is just so so crazy. Oh my god, we have so much iron. I didn't even notice that. All right. Well, we need more coal. Very, very low on coal, but I don't even want to traverse. Wow, isn't it crazy to have more iron than coal? I've had worlds. <sighs> god. I've had worlds where I literally have more diamonds than coal. Which is just insane, because you know, coal doesn't spawn in deep slate. And that's pretty much where I only mine in this game. God. I don't want to get lost, though. Okay, nice. I'll put that there just to see. Then we can mine all this coal. <laughs> this is crazy. This is seriously a, a, a crazy experience. Even though nothing has happened yet, we haven't seen any monsters. Just the idea that they're there is uh, is horrifying. I hope that's coming across on the video at least, because that's how I feel. With all this ambiance that the game is constantly playing. And then I head back to base, and I think, at this point, we can make a full set of iron armor. Oh, uh, it was this way, wasn't it? Oh god. Yeah, there's the spider on the wall. Um, yeah, nice. Good thing I lit the way up. Okay. We can make a full set of iron armor plus tools. I want to work on the armor first. What is that noise? What is that noise? Oh my god, you can't... What the hell is going on? What the hell is going on? This is legitimately terrifying. It's so pitch black. It's so... You would literally only see their eyes if they were down any of these corridors. You would only see their eyes. Oh. 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 Cause 
their eyes glow. I th you know, I think we're safe. I don't know how safe, you know, safe is, but I think we're doing okay. Nice, now we have a full set of iron armor. Feel a lot more confident with the shield plus the armor. Now, the only thing we really need is food. And then, we're okay. At least until we get diamonds, we're okay. The wood supply is pretty limited as well. You know, we don't have like trees or anything down here. Here we go again. More ambience. I don't know if it's necessarily ambience or if it means something. Because that is terrifying. And now I just can't see. Oh, God. Alright, we'll place it down for now. Now, what is that? Now, what is that? I hate this. I hate this so much. <laughs> and I know I gotta go somewhere. You know? I have to eventually go find diamonds. I have to eventually find diamonds. I have to get food. I don't know how I'm going to get food. I mean, if I get hit, it's like very dangerous right now. My plan is if I see anything. All this ambience, by the way, all this music that you're hearing in the background, this is not edited into the video. This is in the game. Oh, God. Oh, God, I can't see. I can't see if I do that. And those, like, groans of dwellers. The game's probably so mad at me for never leaving my spot. But at this point, it's like, <laughs> why would I leave? I'm terrified. <laughs> oh, God, okay. We gotta leave, though. We gotta explore. We have to explore. We have to explore. At least for, at least a bit, right? At least a bit. We have to get food. We can get that... I was gonna say we can get that gold, but... To be fair, I don't think there's much of a point to. We'll get the coal, though. And then up here... Interesting. Actually, interesting. Up here, there's water. So we can make a bucket. And then... I don't want it to flood the place. Get the water. Perfect. So that could be useful. Having water like that, that could be useful. Uh, if a cave dweller is trying to get us, you know, put the water down like how you do in the end with Enderman. And then maybe they can't swim. Hopefully they can't swim. But I know not all the dwellers are the same, you know. Some do different things. Some, actually, I don't know if I said this at the beginning, so I may be repeating myself. But there's one dweller who watches you from a distance and then when you see him he disappears and i think that's just a regular cave sound and then when you see him he yeah he disappears and he's invisible he walks towards you invisible you can hear his footsteps and then he just appears out of nowhere and just starts attacking you don't really want to go that way so that's something that's just terrifying. I mean, that's scary. Oh, wow, what? Wait. What? I I actually had no idea that logs spawned down here? Oh! What the hell? I must be right next to... an ocean monument. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, it's so bad. Five minutes of this. That is so unlucky. <laughs> is it not? That's incredibly unlucky. I suppose the g goal now is to try to get as low as possible. Kinda trapped here. And try to find diamonds. Right?
Oh. There we go. There's something. We do have food. God dang it. I hate these noises. Can it stop? Can the game just stop, please? Oh my god. Hey. Okay. Okay, we can get some rotten flesh from this guy. Nah, man. Those those berries give food too, don't they? I really I really hate this. All this ambiance of the music and and just this random stuff happening. God, all these sounds. What the hell are all these zombies spawning from? Damn it. God, get away from me. I mean, what's going on here? Oh my god, it's a skeleton. Oh, this is so bad. I, I literally have to sit here until my mining fatigue is up. Oh god, I'm so low already. This is really bad. This is really bad. You know, while I'm sitting here thinking what I may do to get a lot of food is I may kill some spiders. You know, if I can find any, which I should be able to. There's a cave spider spawner up there in the mine shaft. Make a fishing rod. Build like a little hut around the water. And then just fish until I have a lot of food. Because with six dwellers in a cave with me, Two hearts on hardcore mode is a suicide mission, honestly. Okay. The fatigue just ended. Nobody here. <laughs> but one shot from a skeleton may be all it takes. There it is right up there. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I need to do something. No, no, no. Oh, this is so bad. Oh my God. Oh. My. God. Dang. Water cave. It just burnt out all my torches. I just need to get this food. More food. Okay, let's get this one. And we should be healing up now. 
No. We need all this food. Now let's heal. That was terrifying. We're good. That was like out of a movie, man. <laughs> we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. These don't give very much food at all, but hey, it's better than absolutely nothing. Which is what we had before. We got very lucky finding this. It seems like my hunger just goes down so quickly. Let's just stand here for a bit and then regain. Because our hunger won't go down if we just stand still. Or it will. Wait, what? That's not how hunger... Wait, did these things make you lose hunger? I, I've never known that. Because I, th I was like, man, I'm sure losing hunger fast, aren't I? And I was, I guess. I guess this stuff probably just... Dang. Probably just makes you lose hunger really quickly. Wow. What is going on? I kind of want to see. Like, is there a monster this way? Because that noise made it sound like it. Although I don't see anything. I do find it kind of odd how we've been playing for a while and haven't... Haven't seen a monster. I hear guardians above us. What is going on in the above world? There's guardians. There's not guardians above us. We're in a... What is going on with that? We're at a... What is this called? Deep Slate. Like, there aren't guardians above us. What is going on there? What is that noise? What is that? Is that him? What the hell? Why does it do that? We can use that to escape later, I guess. If we really need to escape from something. What is that? The goal here is to get string. What is that? That is some... Oh! Oh, I saw it. Oh. Oh no. Are they all attacking at once? Oh. My God. Oh my God. Get rolled. Oh God. What? Oh my God, I thought he was gonna... Oh. He can't get through, can he? No, he can't. He can't. He can't get through. Oh my God. He has a... Uh, quite a range. Quite a range on that attack. Oh, uh, hello? Okay. That is when blocks come in handy. That is when blocks come in handy. So, guys, that was one of the dwellers. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. That was pretty scary. We need a better source of food than this. Okay. Let's make the fishing rod. And yeah, let me get some more wood. The wood is super important. More wood, more string. And then we need to find a water source. And just do some fishing for a bit. Just get some stuff. I also need more coal. Running very low on coal. I'm just gonna do this to fish. <laughs>
It's also been a minute since I've actually fished in Minecraft, so I believe just the bobber needs to go down, right? I mean, it looks like something's pulling on it right now. Keeps making bubbles and stuff. But doesn't the bobber have to be underwater for there to be a fish on it? Can, f can fish even spawn in a man-made... Oh. Well, there you go. That's so weird, isn't it? Like, how do fish spawn from that? Okay. Well, cool. Oh, wow. I've never caught a puffer fish in this game. You can cook those, right, and eat them? <laughs> I mean, I've never done it before. The only thing I know you can do with a puffer fish is, uh, and I made a short video about this, the only thing I know you can do with a puffer fish is you can place it in water, but uh, the funny thing I like to do with it is you place it in water and then you place carpet on top of the water because the puffer fish can poison a player if they're on carpet. So then you're, you just like, you just tell your friend, you're like, oh, come here, come here. And then they start walking towards you, but you just place puffer fish under carpet and then they start taking poison damage and they're like, what is going on? <laughs> It's a fun little troll. Fun little troll to do on your friends. Or just on people in like a PvP server, I guess. Y'all should do that. No, actually. Y'all should do that on my server. That would be pretty funny if y'all did that. And then I can make a video of it. Y'all should... Yeah. Someone should set up like a TP trap. Like a funny little TP trap where they got a bunch of puffer fish. Put the puffer fish in water under carpet. Do it on my server. Vivoli.net. Send me a message on Discord. Uh, my Discord's in the uh, description of this video. Send me a message on Discord if you've already got it set up. You got a ton of pufferfish, and you're and you want to TP trap players so I can get on so I can record that. That would be so funny. Oh my god! Please, somebody do that. That would be hilarious. And yeah, if if you don't know the name of my server, like I said earlier, Vivoli.net. You can join on Bedrock, mobile, PC. You know all that good stuff. Oh god! Oh, I didn't even see that. God, I didn't even see him there. I did not even see him there. I was not paying attention to that at all. Whoa. He seriously came from nowhere. Wow. That really diminished my shield. That really diminished my shield. He did a lot of damage. Okay, that freaked me out. That freaked me out. I really was not expecting that. Oh my God. I'm going to have to, <laughs> I can't wait to watch that when I edit this <laughs> and to see where he was because I didn't even see him. I just heard that noise. Woo. Oh, I think it is time though. I think it is time that we go ahead and look for diamonds. Are you kidding me right now? I wonder what the cause of that is. That's got to be a dweller. A dweller I haven't seen. Oh, I do have sticks, okay. But I wanna make a new pickaxe and axe just because I have, honestly, an abundance of iron. And I'm honestly, even though they're not done, throw that out, throw that out, throw that out, and that out. And honestly that, and honestly, honestly this. All right, well now I'm mining fatigued for another four minutes, that's great. There's no possible way I, we're, we are next to an ocean monument, like, there's no possible way we're getting out of here. We're going deep, 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 like we were before. We're finding diamonds. That is the goal, no matter how difficult the task may seem. <laughs> uh, I keep hearing, like, uh, you know, the noise of, like, guardians shooting or whatever. And I'm like, oh, I must be next to, you know, a monument. But th that's got to be some type of dweller. That makes that noise, because it's like, we are... I mean, all the way down here, you can't tell me there's, like, you cannot hear an ocean monument. What? We're on negative 30. Wow. 
This lush cave is seemingly endless. You're old noob. Uninstall the game, buddy. Uninstall the game, you're bad. God, there has to be diamonds down here. Oh, I thought that was them. I was about to scream, uh, go into hallelujah mode. Well, god dang it. Stop, please! Please, 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 please. Mercy. Let me eat my glowberries. What? Oh my god, there's, he's right there. Get the hell away from me, dude. the other one go hello hello nice to see you um you know where did the other one go Hello. Oh. Is he is he a friend or a foe? <laughs> what? Oh, okay. Um Well, I'm just gonna head out now. Hope you have a have a good one over there, man. And um, do you think I should kill him? He just disappeared. Okay. Yeah, I could kill him. You think? Huh? <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna respawn there, right? Uh, as per usual, he will respawn there, right? Oh yeah, I can. What the hell? Wait, I think this is the invisible dweller. I think that's the invisible dweller. Basically what that one does, I mentioned it at the beginning of the video, but I understand, you know, some people probably skip around. Uh, that dweller, I, I think, uh, maybe I'm wrong. I, I know one of the, Ooh. I know one of the dwellers do this and I'm assuming it was that one. I think it's gone now for good. But that dweller, you see it and then it turns invisible. <laughs> <laughs> and then it turns invisible and it moves around invisible you can't see it oh my god this is a crazy cave by the way can't see a damn thing moves around invisible and then it will just like spawn behind you or not even spawn it walks up behind you because it, it walks you know it's, it's just an invisible mob oh my god look at this I wish, I wish the diamonds glowed. Um, and then it starts attacking you. That's the goal of... I'm assuming that mob. This is a massive cave, by the way. This is just ridiculous. I'm looking for diamonds! It's all I care about. Oh, <gasps> We found some. Alright, dwellers, no more spawning. Because I found diamonds. What? <laughs> Curse you, 1.20! <laughs> Bro, this update of the game killed it, man. I wish I had a miner helmet. 
not the dream kind of miner. I mean like, uh, you know, like the, the mining helmets they have with the light on top of it. Maybe the next time we do something like this, like some like horror mod like this, maybe I could download something for a miner cave. Or a miner, uh, helmet. God dang, zombies. Dude, why are there so many babies? I hear another one to my right. And why does he keep playing this music? Why is there so many babies? <laughs> Oh, damage! Yeah, woo! Awesome. All right, we have enough. We can leave. We can leave this horrible place. We can leave it behind. Leave it in the sand. Leave it in the dirt. Leave it in the dust. I will be honest, though. I, I did think the uh, the dwellers would spawn a lot more frequently, but we did it. Mm, this is basically the end. <laughs> Hopefully, I don't eat my words. Diamond pick. Ooh. What was that? Oh my god! Huh? Ah! No! No! God! God dang it! Oh my god, we were so close. We were so close! Well, it's game over. I died. But I do want to show y'all something real quick before we end it, because I think this is pretty funny. <laughs> oh man. Hopefully y'all find it as funny as I do. That's all I can hope for, honestly. We're gonna get to it soon. Here it is. <laughs> yeah, we we <laughs> yeah. Uh, the the top wasn't full of obsidian. That was just a uh, part of the lore, <laughs> part of the story. <laughs> I hope y'all find that, you know, I hope y'all aren't upset about that, like, oh man, that sucks, that's so annoying. I hope y'all understand, you know, it was like, you know, for the video, you know, made it seem cooler. I think that makes it seem cooler, you know, otherwise it's like, well, why am, it, why am I in that cave? I just felt like that was a fun, like, story thing, I don't know. Wow, this shader is incredible. Oh, God! Oh my god, it does so much damage! <gasps> oh, wow! Wow, this is pretty scary too. We didn't even see all the dwellers. Uh, the last one we that actually killed us was was uh it was the, it looked like it was the same model. I wonder if because I I put so many dwellers in one world, the the mo it made them share the same model at times. Because that dweller that killed us at the end was a different dweller. That was the corpse stalker. Wow, crazy. Anyway, we made it. We made it. We made it above. We got out of the cave. That was the whole goal. You know, maybe in the future we'll do another video like this with more dwellers. <laughs> but we'll do it above ground. And then maybe, you know, I can figure out some goal, some type of goal for that video. Right? But I felt like this was pretty fun. Uh, this was really enjoyable for me. I hope y'all enjoyed it as much as I did, honestly. Um, yeah, so... Like the video if you liked it, guys, you know, subscribe if you haven't, and I guess if you want to see more content like this, if not, it's all good. Uh, but, yeah. Next, we're going to survive a zombie apocalypse.